Alberta is a province rich in water bodies and their surrounding riparian areas. So much so that if you combined all of the riparian areas of every river, creek, wetland, and lake in Alberta, they would wrap around the earth approximately 31 times. That is a lot of riparian area. Landowners, stewardship groups, governments, and land managers all help to care for these sensitive areas so they're able to perform all their important ecological functions. In order to do this, on-the-ground assessments of the watershed, performed by trained professionals, are critical to help make informed decisions on the landscape. However, it would take many lifetimes to complete these assessments for all riparian areas in Alberta. In conservation, every dollar matters. Groups working on the landscape needed a resource that could be used in conjunction with their current tools to help efficiently identify which riparian areas in the watershed need the most attention, either for protection or for restoration. The Riparian Web Portal is a collection point for displaying riparian data, highlighting on-the-ground projects, and sharing resources. Let's take a tour. Click on the Riparian Map Data tab to open an interactive map where you can zoom into the watershed and view the riparian intactness data for a specific water body or area. The intactness legend of green, yellow, orange, and red shows how intact thousands of kilometers of riparian area are. Highly intact shorelines are dominated by natural vegetation and other natural land cover types, while shorelines with very low intactness are dominated by human-built structures, roads, and manicured or disturbed vegetation. Use the Map and Tools drop-down menu to select different base maps like streets or satellite view, and turn on or off the watersheds and municipal boundaries layers. Under the Tools section, you'll find the Spatial Summary tool. Open the tool and select a watershed, sub-watershed, lake, creek, or river to see the overall intactness scores for that region or water body. The percentage of very low to high intactness is shown in the colored bar. Water body, watershed, and municipal summary reports are also available on the portal. Click on the Contact tab and send us a message to find out how you can get summarized data for your region or water body. Project managers who help steward and restore riparian areas can attend a training session to gain login access for higher resolution intactness data, as well as catchment pressure and prioritization data sets. The login access also allows them to upload their own projects to highlight the good work being done in their region. These on-the-ground riparian projects are indicated on the map by stars. Click on a star to see information and pictures of what real people are doing on the ground to make a difference. This is where data meets action. Curious to learn more about riparian areas, how we measure their health, and what you can do to help protect and restore these important areas? Visit the Information tab to access and browse a wealth of riparian resources and educational materials that can help you expand your knowledge and turn your riparian project ideas into reality. Riparian areas come in all shapes and sizes, and due to human activity on the landscape, they vary tremendously in their level of intactness and the important ecological services they provide. There are many ways to measure the health and intactness of riparian areas, and each method helps to support important conservation and restoration work being done on the landscape. Look at the portal's Taking Action section under the Information tab for resources on what you can do. Conservation takes a community, so no matter who you are or where you live, work, or play in the watershed, you can make a positive difference, because we all play a role in creating a healthy watershed.